Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to replace the airbag clock spring on a 2011 Toyota Land Cruiser. I promise you it's going to be a very short video, right to the point, no unnecessary talking. So please bear with me. Disconnect your battery before you touch anything. If you have your original Land Cruiser key, you should have this piece of metal is attached to it. And we're going to use it to pop this cover out, just like that. Now I'm going to use the same key that I used before to open the second cover by the cruise control. Just like that. Now we have a third one over here and it's just a regular screwdriver. Now in order to take the airbag out, we need to disconnect these three cables, these two and this one right here. So for these two, they're locked. So I'm gonna use this little screwdriver to unlock them, just like that. Now that we took the airbag piece out, we wanna disconnect these two connectors using the same screw, just like that. Push down and pull. Now we're gonna open this bolt right here so we can take the whole steering wheel out and make remember when you open it don't open it all the way out and I'll show you why it'll, it'll come right at you so that's why you leave it a few threads on so it'll act as as a brake and prevent it from hitting you now you're gonna need to open these two screws to take this cover out and this out now here's the clock spring that was on the vehicle and this is the new This, the old one, there are clips in here. Release them and take this piece out. You need this piece. So you put the old one aside and you bring the new one. And attach it. So you hear the clicks. So now here you have it. Just make sure that all the clips went all the way in so you have it safe and secure. It's all one piece now. Now we're ready to reassemble it again. So you take this harness, click it. Take the other one. Make sure it's all the way in. Always make sure to hear the clicks. And then you hook these three clips. and clean and now it's time to take this piece out and make sure when you take it out this doesn't rotate see just take it out now we're gonna 
try to put the covers back on. put the steering wheel back on make sure these lines are perfectly aligned and we want to make sure it's really tight now the airbag piece. So just remember this harness goes here and these two harnesses will go here and it's color coded so you can't go wrong. So before you clip this back on make sure to pull the locks back like this. And this way when you put it in its housing and the airbag piece you push this all the way down and it'll lock it that will be just like this now it should fall into place and now we're gonna screw this torque screw here and one here and then we put the covers back on and we should be done now we connected the battery back again, turn the ignition on to wait for the system to reload. Now the system is completely rebooted. In comes the light and here we go. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video and most importantly, I really hope that you guys learned something. If you, I would really appreciate it if you would subscribe to the channel. If you don't, I understand. I will still thank you for watching. If you like, I can do other videos. Just let me know in the comment section or you can email me and I will respond to you right away. I appreciate it again and have a great day.